Okay, now let's take a look at some light rail products and get to know what they do. And here's all the hardware light rail sells. There are stop kits with thumb screws, tent hangers that make it super easy to add a mover to any tent, and robo sticks for turning bigger hoods perpendicular to the direction of travel, which is exactly what you want when you have a garden with that long, narrow shape. And then there's their Adalamp kit. It comes with an extra trolley and the motor adapter that attaches to the push rod and it comes with a six foot rail. And I'm showing you all this because I want you to understand how important it is that you move your light. Because in the photosynthesis equation, there's only two things that are gonna get you more yield, right? And that's more light and more CO2. Remember, yield is based on light and quality on grower talent. And that's because in the photosynthesis equation, plants use light for energy to combine water and CO2 into sugar and oxygen. Notice there are no nutrients in this equation and since adding more water only rots the roots, that means you can only add more light and more CO2. But then what else besides CO2 and a light rail is going to get you 25% more yield for just 7 watts of electricity and no more cooling costs. That's why this image is so important, because once you invest in a light or two, not moving them is crazy. They also have trolley and motor replacement wheels. There are four wheels and four screws in each kit, and Gualala even has an extreme duty wheels kit that can support today's biggest hoods. These things come with a lifetime guarantee too. Imagine that, more yield for less money and a lifetime guarantee. You can't beat that. Let's take a look at Gualala Robotics Motors now. They have a 3.5 that lets you control the delay and the 4.0 that lets you control the delay and the speed. And if you need to replace the drive wheel, there's a kit and a video on how to do that too. You can also get three foot rails that can combine into six and nine foot rails if you wanna move your light further or you wanna move two lights. But Gualala recommends you use a one piece six foot rail instead of combining two three foot rails if you're going to attach it to a tent with their hangers.